Okay. Okay. So on to mass center four. We're talking about decimals. We're gonna talk about rounding and um, rounding and decimal place value. So, so first we're going to talk about place value, looking at IXL again. Um, which place is in the eight? So that's ones. Okay. Actually, I don't like this one. Okay, I found what I wanted. All right, um, in 8,064 and 927 thousandths, which is a ditch is in the tens place, that would be the six. Okay, the two is in what place? So it wouldn't be over here, two is going to be a ten. I don't like these either. Why are these just not what I want? So let's just look together, shall we? Decimal place value. And that's what I was using, but I don't like that one. Let's go to rounding decimals. It looks like you guys have done that a lot. All right, so eight and eight tenths round to the nearest whole number is going to be nine. Okay, so let's work on this one together. Seven and one and fifty-two thousandths. Okay, so I am going to, well, first of all, I forgot what am I rounding to? Round of the nearest tenth. So I'm going to underline my tenth, circle my five. That five is going to um, make that one go up. So my new number is going to be seven and two tenths. Seven point two. All right, we'll just do a couple of these. Four hundred sixty-one thousandths and rounded to the nearest hundredth. So nearest hundredth, and that one is going to make that six stay the same. So my number is my answer is forty-six hundredths. Well, let me open something else that doesn't need to be open. 46. All right, let's do one more. 8 and 22 hundredths rounded to the nearest tenth. That's my tenth spot. And that 2 is going to kick it to 8 and 2 um, tenths. Remember that if you cannot think of how to say the number or you don't can't remember what place value something is in, you put your 1 under there and then fill in with zeros. So when you look, Oh, you can't see. When you look, that one is over the tenth, uh, the five uh, is over the hundred, and the two is over the thousandths. So that is how you can sort of keep up with the place value. Okay. All right. There's only a few questions to do on decimal, rounding, and place value.